Hi, welcome to Kids in Worship. My name is Miss Julie. And today we have a story called The Transfiguration of Jesus. Before we start our stories, we always begin with the same song so that we can get ourselves into the right frame of mind. It's called Be Still and Know. Our friend Miss Lauren is going to go ahead and sing it for us, so please join us as we sing it together. Be still and know that I am God. Be still and know that I am God. Be still and know that I am God. Jesus and his disciples were teaching in the villages and the countryside. Jesus had been saying such amazing things and doing such wonderful things, but people didn't really know who he was. So one day, Jesus asked his disciples, Who do people say that I am? They answered, Some say you are John the Baptist. Some say you are Elijah or a prophet. But who do you say I am? Jesus asked. Peter said, you are the Christ. You are blessed, Peter, Jesus said, for God has shown you who I really am. Then Jesus said, I must go to Jerusalem for Passover. I will be killed on the third day, but God will make me alive again. But the disciples didn't really understand what that meant. Jesus taught them for six more days, and then he led Peter, James and John to a high mountain to talk with God. Peter, James, and John. As Jesus was talking with God, he was transfigured. His face began to shine as bright as the sun. His clothes became a dazzling white. And Elijah and Moses appeared on his side. Suddenly, a cloud covered the area. The disciples were terrified. Then a voice said, This is my child whom I love. Listen to him. Looking around, the disciples saw only Jesus. Don't be afraid, Jesus said. Come, follow me. There's a lot to discuss in this story. I have a lot of wonder questions, and I bet you do too. So this would be a good time to talk to your group of kids sitting next to you or your family at home to talk about what you wonder about this story. <laughs> 